we have an artist who is quoted as being the next breakaway alternative country star. And I tend to agree. She has a way of pulling her innermost, deepest, heartfelt feelings <coughs> to the surface and putting them to music and lyric. Her latest album is called Lucky Penny, and it is a gem, and it's on, on sale right over there. Y'all need to pick that up. <coughs> uh, she has a song recorded by Rosie Flores called Once Again with Feeling. She has a song with a new Rita Coolidge album. And currently, she's doing an album project with Disney. Ladies and gentlemen, please give a very warm welcome to Reva Hunter. Hi, everybody. It's just going to take a minute to set up here. And uh, I want to thank you all for coming in. Just talk among yourselves for a moment or two, and we're going to get set up here. So I want you all to forget every word. I'll thank Mary Lee. Um, well, it really is uh, important to, to be up here in the uh, afterglow and moon glow of such powerful words of, of writers and poets. Um, I think all human beings know what it is to struggle to uh, have their own particular battle on this earth between their longings for love, which we all have and are entitled to, and are entitled to uh, pursue their fulfillment. And they often difficult reality of that which is often cradled in the uh, arms of, of some beautiful moments as well. And uh, we've come here tonight to raise money for women who have been in abusive relationships. And I think in one way or another maybe not everyone on the violent, physical violent, and on the spectrum, but that we all have been in one time of our lives um, allowed ourselves to feel victimized. And I think it's so important for, for all of us, and us as women, to find the places where we can be strong <coughs> and we can see through our own illusions of other people and be able to utter those truths clearly. And um, so I feel honored to be part of this. And I'd like to sing for you a couple of songs tonight that um, are just about being strong or, or looking through our own illusions. This first song is about finding out that a lot of things that I wanted to be true weren't necessarily true. Trust the moon, the way it shines. 
song that I wrote about a woman who bumped into me down at the Santa Monica Pier, who uh, seemed to have lost touch. And I started thinking about a lot of things, and I wrote this song called Falling from Grace. She bumped into me as we crossed the crowded street with her torn up eggs and ribs and wounded feet. And I thought hereby, for the grace of God, it's her and not me.
it has severe repercussions. <laughs> Which it always does, so, you know. You might as well say what's in your heart and have repercussions anyway, right? what is, well, silence is what gets us, you know? Yeah. Silence is what always gets us, in one way or the other. Anyway, this is called In My Heart of Hearts.
Thank you. Now, you all heard this song already tonight. But um, it's an important message of healing. And, and that is, sometimes it's a lot more important to watch what someone does and not what they say. Scott, you can tell a lot about the man, and I wrote it with Karen Tobin. After the sun goes down With his two belt on There since dawn Standing in a rocking chair He found He doesn't even notice Me or his cat Callous hands But by the way That he works You can tell a lot About the man Set the wing of a wounded dove, kept it in the yard to bend. Got up in the night to sandbag the creek when a storm came rolling in. There are things that I feel he don't always understand. But by the way that he listens, you can tell a lot about the man. To this heart of mine, something in his eyes that says, I'll always give a damn. Tell a lot about the man. 